guys, this is Wu Li. Today we're going to go over what I consider by far the most powerful build in the game. Um, and that is largely due to the Lens Rapid. So we're pretty much building this build around the Lens Rapid. Hello, baby. Alright, back to the subject. Um, so and that's largely due to the Lens Rapid. Now, what you're looking for in this build, is this is more of a combo build. So what you're looking for as your weapons start spawning, so when you're into the game, what you're ideally looking for is a Nova and the regular Lens and also the Lens Rapid. Okay, so you pretty much want to see this three. This is your ideal spawn. Okay? And you, what you want to do is you want to go ahead and grab the Nova first and feel free to grab on the Lens. So once you do that, you're going to shoot out the Nova, and then you're going to follow by with both the lens. You're going to shoot the blue one first, you're going to shoot twice on the purple, one more on the blue, and one more on the purple. The reason for this is because the blue uh, lens has a longer cooldown, so you cannot shoot right away, you have to wait quite a while, right? So you the cooldown right here. Guys. Sorry about that, back to subject. So because once you when you shoot a blue lens, when you shoot it, there's a cooldown right here, right? So it takes a lot longer. Whereas the purple lens, boom, it's a lot faster that you can reshoot it. So therefore, it's better to shoot one blue, two purple, and then followed by one blue, one purple. So boom, you have this thing that's just kind of cover up your enemy's base, right? Uh, your enemy's platform. And so it's gonna be Nova. Laser, boom, 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 boom. Followed by fast shooting weapon, the three weapon, the raptor, the hammer, and the Viper Ellipse. Okay, but your key component here is really this two lens, right? You can use them however you like. That's how I like to use it. The reason I usually like to start with the Nova is because the Nova is really slow moving. So let's say you, you fire the lens, right? And then you fire Nova. It takes too long to get to your opponent. By the time the Nova gets there, the lens already disappeared. So I'd rather start with the Nova, bait out if the opponent has, let's say, a Nova, or you know, they might use it to block your Nova. So you bait it out with your Nova, and then you follow up with your lens. And then you want to go to your faster weapons for immediate follow-up. Um, so if they have a no way from them, your hammer might clear it out, and then the laser might get to them. Um, so that is pretty much the combo and what you're using this build to play around. And the reason this build is so good is because this two, which is your core component, right? Um, the cooldown it takes to spawn on your board takes 10, 4. So that only takes 14 seconds. So you could pretty much run through this 3 to 4 times in 2 minutes of a match. Okay, so the chance of you getting this spawn three to four times, and usually, okay, this is why I'm playing like really good player like Gold Knight. So I'm playing Gold Knight, a lot of times we don't end up killing each other, so it's very important that you're chipping each other's health. And each, uh, each run through, usually minimum, I can chip about 25%. So if you run through three to four times, you know, I mean, even the best player, they're pretty much dead. Okay, now there are times that they dodge extremely well and they'll dodge, you know, they'll be able to dodge it, but it's just pretty difficult because you're doing, you know, five lasers and that's just a long laser. Okay, so, uh, oh yeah, so how do you shoot them correctly? Okay, so you pretty much can shoot however you want. I mean, they're pretty decent, you know, pretty effective. You're covering a wide area. Uh, but how I like to do it is usually I like to shoot them straight. Okay, so I like to first shoot the first shot where the opponent is predict right away where they're going to go, and then as they move around, you kind of cut them off. Never shoot, try to never shoot everything in one space, but rather slightly spread them out. But you don't want to shoot like, you know, if the opponent is all the way on this side, you don't want to do like, you know, you don't want to shoot all the way down here, right? Spreading them out. You're trying to spread them out, but maybe like something like, instead of going all the way over here, maybe you go something like, 
you know, you make maybe go something like this. So they want to go th go through. They have to go through all the lasers, and then if they're on the other side, you start spamming them, and they can't go anywhere because this is all lasers in the middle. Um, so pretty much, yeah. So that's what the whole build is going to be around. Now, sometimes you're gonna have this three, right? So what is the reason behind, like, why would you want to have this three in your deck? Um, the reason for the hammer and the raptor is because they have extremely low cooldown. You have a three second on this, right? So every three seconds, this one will be able to stop. Every second, the raptor will be able to stop, okay? So, um, and how I usually use it, you can use it however you like, okay? But how I usually use it is I would like to pair a, ra a hammer or a raptor with my Viper Ellipse. So, and what I do is I always have the Viper Ellipse in my dominant hand, and the other hand will be one of the low cooldown weapons. So I would do the opposite side, right? So I will shoot my uh, hammer or my or my um, raptor on my left hand side, and then I'm gonna do a diagonal curve up to the other side with my Viper. So it's gonna be boom, 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 boom. Right? So a lot of times when you're shooting this, the opponent is going to go to that side, right? As they go to that side, you're going to shoot your Viper, and hopefully that'll hit. That's a nice 30 damage chunk right there. You can do the same thing with the hammer. Boom, boom, boom. Okay. But what I usually do is if I see a Raptor versus a hammer, I always take the Raptor first. That is because if the opponent has a Nova, your hammer can destroy the Nova. And technically, um, in terms of a direct comparison, the hammer does counter the Nova because the Nova is a seven second spawn, whereas the hammer, two plus together, you know, two, six, two three seconds plus together is six. So you technically have right, right about the same cooldown. Nova actually takes a little bit longer, like one second longer, but you will have four shots versus three Nova. Um, but Nova is very good because Nova you could use it offensively and at the same time you could use it defensively. So if the enemy has lasers and they don't have you know, a Nova, this is where your advantage comes in, right? So laser coming at you, you could go ahead and just pile Nova on top of each other and try to block the laser. Um, or you could like, you know, move around and then when you cannot, then you block it, right? So yeah, so this is my pretty much my build right now. And uh, I believe it is by far the most powerful or the strongest build. Um, now do not take your opponent um, do not just because you have a strong build take your opponent lightly um, because even with this build uh, you can still lose I often lose here and there uh, but this is a this is a very good overall build um, so once again we have a Nova we have the lens we have the lens rapid we have hammer we have vibrate lips and we also have the Rapture I hope you find this video helpful. If you do, go ahead and feel free to subscribe to the channel. Uh, leave a comment down below. Maybe you could talk about like what is your favorite weapon and why. And at the end, uh, and also make sure to thumb up and like the video. And uh, if you are not in the Blast on Discord, be sure to check the Blast on Discord out. I'm gonna go ahead and leave that in the link down below. Uh, if you just bought the game, uh, you could actually get to plat and if you're plat, you get a free copy of the Blast Down game. Um, and you have to kind of let the devs know that you're plat in the Discord, which is down below. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This is Wu Li. Until next time, peace out.